All right, guys, welcome back to the Tutor Learning Center. This is JD Tutor, and we're going to start off with video 16, um, extended distributive method, extended eh, part two and a half, I guess you could say, um, because uh, video 15 was about number eight, only about number eight. And in that video, it taught you not only the distributive method, but it taught you how to multiply only variables, taught you about some secrets to silent one, um, especially on adding exponents. Uh, all right, guys, so let's get started on part two here for the distributive method extended for the rest of the problems. All right, so let's get started. Set on number one, seven times y minus 2x. All right, guys, so distributed method. We can't do anything in here because these are unlike terms. We can't subtract them. All right, 7y. All right, and here, 7 times negative 2x is negative 14x. Are we finished? No, guys, we aren't because these aren't in order x comes before y, so negative 14x plus 7y. All right, guys, that's for number one. All right, and if you uh, are a little behind on writing, pause the video, please. All right, number two. All right, number two, 2x times 14y minus one. All right, distributive method. Can you do anything in here? No, you can't. So we have to do the distributive method. So two, two X times 14 Y is a uh, 28 X Y. And then two X times negative one is negative two X. All right, guys, and we can leave it like that. We don't have to switch anything around. The X, Y can come before the X. All right, guys, number three, number three. All right, so number three is seven times Y minus two X plus 2x times 14y minus 1. Sorry, guys. That is a 14. All right. Oops. OK, so 7 times y minus 2x plus 2 time, um, 2x times 14y minus 1. All right, let's take these in steps, guys, and we're going to split them up and do them one at a time. All right, just like we did with number 8 here all right, on the last video. So let's do 7 times y is 7y. 7 times negative 2x is negative 14x. All right. And guys, I, I've taken some of these, drop down your plus, I've taken some of these out of the same ones that we previous just previously did. So um, it'll make a lot more sense to you. OK, um, so now on the other side. So uh, positive 2x times 14 is positive 28xy. All right, and then 2x times negative 1 is negative 2x. All right, guys. So do we see any like terms here? I do. I see this one and this one. All right. So let's do 7y. Now let's approach these. Um, we have a negative and a negative. Um, we're going to add them in the golden rule of addition and subtraction. Uh, we're going to add them so and keep the same sign. So negative 16x, and we'll say plus 28xy. All right, guys, so can we do this one and this one? No, we cannot because uh, this has an x in there. So they that makes it unlike terms, unlike terms. Can we do this one and this one? 
no, we cannot because that Y in there makes it unlike terms. All right, guys, we cannot do that. All right, so this is um, our answer, but let's organize these. This X, Y component here has to be in front, has to be in front. And then this is next because X comes before Y. So negative 16 plus 7Y. And then in your public schools, uh, they may have you practice putting these in order as well. All right, like we're doing right now. All right, so that would be it right here. Here's your answer, 28XY minus 16. Oh, for, I forgot the X, 16X plus 7x, 28xy minus 16x plus uh, 7y. Excuse me, I don't know why I'm messing up here. Ah, okay, guys. One more time, 28xy minus 16x plus 7y. There you go, there you go. All right, number four. Let's do number four. All right. All right, guys, so let's do uh, number four is nine minus 31 M. Okay, so don't let the placement of this M fool you. It is the same exact thing, okay? So M times nine is nine M and M times negative 31 is negative 31 M. And yes, you can combine these in subtraction because they are like terms. Uh, they're actually fully like terms. Um, so we're gonna do negative 22 M and that is your answer for it, number four. And number five is just like it. Number five is just like it. So we'll do number five. Okay. Oh, one times two M plus nine. All right. Link one times two M is two M. And of course, one times nine is plus nine. And there you go, guys. We don't have to rearrange anything. All right, that's for number five. And number six. Nine minus 31. M plus one times two m plus nine all right guys here once again we can look at number four look back at number four and see how you did that and look back uh here at number five and see how you did that okay all right so but we're gonna combine them um so m well actually can we do, I, there's something I didn't do on number four because I wanted to show you the distributive method, but can we combine these as like terms before we do the M? Yes, we can because parentheses first, remember that, and they are like terms. So let's do negative 22 times M and we're still kind of doing the distributive method anyway, all right? So we did that side. Let's do the side before we do this. Uh, let's do, um, uh, we can't do, we cannot combine like terms here because uh, they're unlike terms in addition. All right, so, but what we can do is the distributive method here. And we're gonna do one times two M is two M and one times nine is nine. So now let's do, we can do the distributive method still. So negative 22 times M is negative 22 M plus 2 M plus nine. 
And can we combine like terms? Yes. So if you remember our number lines, uh, negative and a positive, these are like terms, negative and a positive, you subtract, right? Golden rule. So let's subtract. So that would be 20M. And the number with the highest sign is the 22. We keep that one, that sign, plus the nine. All right, can we go any further? No, we cannot because these are unlike terms. All right, that's for number, uh, where are we? Number six, okay. All right, number six. Let's do number seven, guys. And remember, we're gonna skip number eight because number eight solely is in our last uh, video, number 15, video, uh, video 15. So let's do number seven. All right, negative six times 2m minus three. Oops. All right, minus 18. All right, can we combine like terms in here? Um, no, we can't. They're unlike terms in addition and subtraction. So we have to do the distributive method, all right? Negative six times two M is negative 12 M. All right, and negative six times negative three is positive 18. And then take our minus 18. Ah, I see a cancellation method going on here, inverse operations. So, Negative 12m is the answer to number seven. Negative 12m. Okay. And number nine, let's do number nine. So negative six plus three times two plus five y minus 10x. All right, so let's see what we have going on here. Can we do the combined like terms here? No, we cannot. All right, so negative six plus, let's do this area first because this is our, we're going to multiplication next in order, right? Of our uh, PEMDAS, right? Order of operations, so uh, positive three times positive two is a positive six. And then uh, positive three times 15, uh, five Y is 15 Y, 15 Y and minus 10 X. All right, guys, I see another cancellation method there. And we have 15 Y uh, minus, oops, 10 X minus 10x. All right, and now these are not in order. We want x to come before y. Negative 10x plus 15y. Negative 10x plus 15y. All right, guys, that concludes our 16th video. I'll see you in number 17. Thank you, guys.